Some BI client tools, such as Explorer, can connect to SAP HANA without using a universe as an intermediary. To enable this type of connection, you must create a relational connection to the HANA database using JDBC or ODBC drivers directly in the repository, where it can be accessed by the client tools. In this tutorial, you will create a relational connection to SAP HANA in the repository. To connect to SAP HANA, you must first be connected to the repository. Open a session to the BI platform. Right-click the session. Select Open Session. Type Password, and then click OK. Click to expand the session. When creating a connection to SAP HANA for BI client tools, you do not need to create a full universe, so you create the connection directly in the repository, rather than associating it with a project. Right-click the Connections folder. Select Insert Relational Connection. Specify a unique name for the connection. Type SAP underscore HANA underscore rep and then click next. Choose the correct middleware for the connection. Click to expand the SAP drivers. Click to expand the SAP HANA database 1.0 drivers. Select JDBC drivers. Click next. Enter the appropriate credentials for the HANA database. You can specify a single account for the connection that all users will access or you can use business objects credentials mapping and assign the connection to specific users and groups in the central management console. For this connection, use a specified username and password. Click in the username text box. Type R Jones and then click in the password text box. Type password and then click in the server text box. Type the host name and port number and then click test connection. Click Close. Click Next. When creating a connection to HANA, the most important setting is the array fetch size, which controls how many lines are retrieved each time the client tool connects to the database. Increasing the value enables the system to make fewer trips to retrieve the full data set. The default is 10, but it can be increased to a maximum of 1000 for better performance. Higher values run faster queries but require more memory on the client tool that is running the query. Increase the value to 1000. Click in the array fetch size text box. Type 1000, and then click finish. Confirm that the connection has been created. Click to expand the connections folder. Click to scroll down. Double click the SAP HANA rep connection. Click to scroll down. You have successfully created a relational connection to SAP HANA in the repository. This is the end of the tutorial.